Now that there is a Glock 23. It's got a polymer hand grip, so that means it's light. But the thing with that one is, is that it's got no safety, so best be careful where you put your finger. What does it shoot? Nine millimeter. I see. Yep, it's a little bit smaller than the Colt 1911 that you looked at earlier, but it still packs a punch. Now, if you like the 9mm, then take a look at this one. It's 9mm too, but it's called a Beretta. All metal, and it has a safety switch. But because of that, it's going to come a little bit more of an extra price. But you are paying for the quality, and you pay for what you get. I think I like this one better. You called it a Glock? Yep, sir. Glock 23. Look, I don't mean to butt in, um, but you don't exactly look like the kind of person that goes around carrying guns. What exactly are you planning to do with this? I'm gonna kill someone. Whoa, whoa. Look, I don't mean to butt into any of your business, but are you sure you want to go down that path? Look, I mean, what's this man even done to you? It is a man, isn't it? You ain't planning on shooting your wife, are you? No, not my wife. <sighs> well, look, I don't mean to... I don't mean to... add my opinion to things, but... you don't exactly seem like the kind of... tough guy mafioso killer, now don't you? You don't understand. This man ruined my life. Found out yesterday that he's been sleeping with my wife. I don't know how long this has been going on. But I found out after he hit my son. Oh, jeez. Apparently, uh, my, my son had realized that this guy was not me. And um, decided to deal with the situation by shouting at him. This guy decides he, he's going to deal with my son by saying, you know, oh, I, I'm just conducting business with your mother. He then hit my eight-year-old son across the face. He hit him in the face! Look, guy, that's tough. Believe me, I completely sympathize. And I can see your anger. But is it really worth killing a guy over? There's more. This man... Conned my wife out of five thousand dollars. That's five grand of my money. Last night, my wife ran off with him, and he took my money. What's your name, man? John. Well, John, uh, Randall. Well, let me tell you a story, John. When I was twenty-three years old. My older brother was shot and killed on my front lawn by his best friend. Now, I don't know if he did something to piss him off or whatever, but I just, I just couldn't sleep. I was mad all the time. And my daddy, my daddy owned three shotguns, one included for myself. Now, I can't tell you how many times I would unload and reload that 12 gauge, just pacing up and down, just itching to go over to that fucker's house and blow his goddamn head off. But I didn't. My mom had just lost one of her sons. I wasn't about to let that happen to her again. And I'm damn proud of that. But think of your son, John. He's only eight. If you go through with this, well, he'll have lost both his mother and his father all in a matter of hours. Then what? What's gonna happen then, John? I can tell you exactly what's gonna happen then. Your son's gonna wind up in a little corner bed in an orphanage with nothing but his little bed fire truck. Think about that, John. Do you see that in your head? Your little boy will have nothing left but to play with this little red fire truck that he loves so much. Because his father or his mother isn't there and that's gonna be on you. Think about your son, John. 
think about that little red fire truck. Go home. Thank you, Randall. Ah, shit. I ain't here to do the Lord's work or nothing. But I pitch in when I can. Who's that? Oh, that's my next customer. Yeah, he was scheduled him after you, but uh, seeing as how our little schedule went over time, uh, I'd say that's him now. Uh, damn it, I didn't want to be seen here. Why not? Come on. What? Is it the cops? It's the guy. It's the fucking guy! What guy? The guy I've been talking about this whole time. I, I, I'm well, not here. It looks here. like he had similar here. intentions. Uh, What can I do for you today? Uh, I, I need a gun fast. A gun fast, sir! We have all kinds of guns. What kind are you looking for? I don't give a shit. Just give me a gun so I can get out of my way. Whoa, whoa, mister. With like an attitude like that, I gotta know what you plan on doing with it. It's this girl I've been seeing. She's, she's got this crazy ex-husband uh -huh. who's been stalking us. I just want a gun in case he you know, tries to hurt us. Ah, okay. Over here we have a nice selection of uh, assault rifles. You son of a bitch! <laughs> It's enough with your guys. Look, I'm sorry. Please don't kill me. Sorry doesn't even Sean, yeah. please. Sean, think about your son. Think about what you're doing. I should shoot you right here, right now. This is what's gonna happen. You're gonna go home and you're gonna get my money. You're gonna bring it back to me, to my house. And while you're at it, you're gonna tell my wife to come home too. It's okay if she doesn't, that's fine. But she's not staying with you. And as for my son, if you ever touch him again, I swear to God, I will fucking murder you. Do you understand? Yes, yes I do. Now go. Do you really think he's gonna do what you said? No. Then why'd you let him go? Because there isn't going to be a little red fire truck. Ooh.